fellow traders you're welcome back to the macho fx squad channel now many requests have come as to how to use the major spikes detector okay so i'm going to show you all three versions of the mega spy detectors on the mobile and then i'm going to switch to the pc and show you how to set them up correctly how to get them and how to set them up correctly to be able to improve your boom and crash trading so stay tuned now this setup that is here is the first version of the mega spy detector and, and i've been holding this particular tree for some time it's a long buy so um in this version this is how the setup looks like you're gonna take stochastic you do the same thing you click down rsi you do the same thing you click done and then you're going to take a boom if the are uh, the stochastic crosses below the rsi and everything is below the level 25 okay crosses below it like this or below the level 25 so this is a correct entry this is correct and then this is also correct and this is okay and in version 1.32 so this is actually version 1.3 in version 1.32 because sometimes we were having a little trouble when the market is in a steep trend maybe downtrend in boom 300 you see that it will be quite difficult to catch the spikes example is this you see where the spikes came it's too far so this is what i implemented uh, i took uh i don't think maybe the 15 minutes or the 30 minutes time frame yeah i think 30 minutes then i added on the main window i add i added moving average moving average um eight so done so that if current price is above moving average eight then and only then would you switch to one minute time frame and then so let me let me let me do something i think all this is in the previous video i uploaded so if you are kind of confused and you wouldn't know how to use it, you can check out my previous video so that we can go fast on this particular video so i'm going to take everything out and then so I'm going to set up the first strategy. Okay, this is version 1.3. So the second strategy, which is version 1.2, that one used um, relative strength index. So you add the levels. You add the levels 15 and then you add the level 85 and done. Um, then the period is four done come to the main window you add parabolic SRL, same settings done we add moving average the moving average is one but you apply this to previous indicators data and the previous indicator data here is a data from the parabolic SAR. So done so what you formed in the main window is called the trend filter and i actually coded this trend filter and then it is available okay it is also available so once you request for the mega spice detector i add this trend filter to it so i'm coming let me check the rsi um style change it to something like black then before no like three pixels and done so yeah basically this is version 1.2 of the mega spice detector and so as you know already when the this line crosses below when the rsi period 4 crosses below the level 15 and all is above the trend filter that means that we are in an uptrend and so when you enter a trade for spikes you get them correctly just like this 
and you take crash. You take crash, the same thing. The trend filter should be above the current price. So that when you enter a trade for spikes, you'll be able to catch the spikes correctly. So that is it. Now let's move on to version um 1.0 or 1.1 of the uh, boom and crash mega spikes and that one was based only on relative strength index with nothing and then it was on five minutes time frame or it's meant to work on the five minutes time frame so once you're on five minutes time frame and then you notice that the level of, uh, the period for the relative strength index crosses above the level 85 then you can enter a trade for spikes like this just like that so in a while i'm going to switch to my pc and i'm going to show you how um each of the versions they are all for free okay and they are in my telegram channel i'm going to leave a link in the description below and so as i move from here to my pc you might just want to subscribe because i'm giving this thing out for free and then um so just stay tuned all right and just smash the subscribe button thank you